Dear students, in this topic, we shall discuss the dormant states, sleep and torpor. Dormancy is a state of slowed down physiological processes and is represented by reduced body activities and reduced metabolic rate. Dormancy has many types. For example, sleep, torpor, hibernation, winter sleep, and estivation. These are classified on the basis of duration of dormancy, ability for arousal during the dormant period, and decrease in the body temperature during this state. First, we shall discuss sleep in detail. Sleep is a naturally recurring state of mind and body which is characterized by altered consciousness, decreased ability to react to stimuli, inhibition of most voluntary muscles and reduced interactions with the surroundings. It is the most thoroughly investigated form of dormancy. Dear students, various animals sleep for different times. The, for example, seals which sleep on ice beds sleep only for few minutes at a time. Humans and many other mammals sleep hours at a time, while big carnivores, for example, lions and tigers sleep up to 20 hours a day, especially after meals. Khana khane ke baad, to ye bohot zyada lamba vakt jo hai wo sote hain. Dear students, sleep is triggered by a variety of factors. The most common triggering factor in mammals is the build up of some sleep inducing substances in the extracellular fluids during the wakefulness timing. This accumulation happens in the central nervous system. The process of sleep is divided into two alternating phases. The first phase, the one phase is slow wave sleep, which is called deep sleep. The second phase is the REM sleep or rapid eye movement sleep. Both these patterns of sleep alternate with each other many times during one sleeping shift. Dear students, the slow wave sleep is associated with a drop in body temperature, a drop in the hypothalamic temperature sensitivity and changes in respiratory and cardiovascular reflexes. The REM sleep is a small portion of the total sleep time. It is associated with the desynchronized and fast brain waves. Rapid eye movements also occur during this phase. This phase is also associated with loss of muscle tone. Suspension of homeostasis also occurs, while the hypothalamic temperature control remains under suspension. Dear students, now we shall discuss another dormant state that is torpor. 
you know that some small endothermic animals are continuous feeders. When they are inactive, they cannot feed during that period of inactivity. Because of non-feeding, they cannot maintain high rates of metabolism without taking energy. To pass the periods of rest, they enter a state of dormancy which is called torpor. During the torpor, body temperature and metabolic rates are allowed to fall. Metabolic rate ko maintain karne ke liye to bahut zyada energy chahi hoti hai. Jab wo energy ki kami ho gai aur animal afford nahi kar sakta, to it will let its body temperature to fall. The basal metabolic rate is also lowered. This lowers the conversion of energy stores into body heat. Jitni body ke paas jo stores hai, kam as kam unko heat may convert karke zaya nahi kiya jata. Dear students, an animal immediately after coming out of torpor has to do certain changes. It undergoes a burst of metabolic activity. Its body temperature rises through shivering or oxidation of brown fat and as a result animal becomes active. Dear students, we shall take few examples of torpor. Daily torpor is practiced by many terrestrial birds. A classic example of daily torpor is found in the hummingbirds. Hummingbirds may body temperature jo ke din ke work takriban 40 degree centigrade per maintain at hai that is allowed to fall to about the level of 13 degree centigrade during torpor. Birds ke lawa mammals ki kuch species bhi daily torpor karti hai for example shiryus.